Hey all, this is Fan Phoenix here, and welcome to my blind reaction series to Angel's Friends. This is episode 21 called Threats on the Horizon. More Raina shenanigans? I hope so, because she's the only thing that makes the show good besides the creepy monster. So let's see what happens. Today's ignore the bad theme song uh, background is Stick With Me Baby by Robert Plant and Alison Krauss. Okay, that's enough. Threats on the horizon. You don't even have time to acknowledge what's going on outside your own window. There are Professor Arkin's lessons to pay attention to. A friend to visit in hopes she'll feel better. Mm -hmm. And the earthly ones to keep your eyes on, to guard them and to protect them, which is a recipe for a very busy day. Yep. And then, then there are always the devils to challenge you. The evening can sneak up on you before you even realize it. But even if you are exhausted, you can still think of more things to fill your day. Yep. <sighs> it's called life. You never have enough time. That's why you have to prioritize. And can never have. Huh? No. Prior prioritization yes. is the Sometimes is part of the key. So planning is good. Planning is very good. Let's go. Lessons are going to be starting soon. So what's the big hurry? We're not anywhere near being late. There's the bell. We should go. <laughs> uh? No your mistress's bidding. Raina has given you a potent poison. Put it to good use. Huh? Uh oh. Let me guess. It bites the wrong people, and we get to do a little uh. Uh, Midsummer's Night's Dream. Please, please let bite the wrong people and have a Midsummer Night's Dream. I would, I would love that. That would be great. But that's probably not gonna be happen. They're too stupid to realize that. What are we supposed to do all day? Well, you know, if you miss school that much, I could always teach. You know, I have the greatest idea. Why don't you help me out with Edward? Why? Does he have a problem? No, at least not yet. I didn't see him in the courtyard. Because he's home. Today is a special day for him. His father is supposed to pick him up. That's the plan. You know, his parents are separated. Edward lives with his mother, and his father works in another city. They almost hmm. never see each other. Okay, so I don't see the problem. His dad is coming. That's great. I only said he was supposed to pick him up. Are you saying that he's not going to be able to come? Mm -hmm. It's already happened a couple of times, and Edward always takes it hard. It's sad. And that's why you're expecting trouble today. That makes mm -hmm. sense. Kabale is not one to waste time to fan the flames. Hmm. Sweet is right. I really think you should go and help her. So, Gabe, are you saying you're not coming with us as usual? That's right. Ever since we've come back from the Caves of Obscurity, I've kept an eye on you, and you haven't gone yourself as once. I gotta tell you, I'm impressed. Ah. <sighs> You've proven you understand the situation, and you deserve my total trust. Well, that's good that she's earned his trust. Hopefully, nothing happens that's gonna break it! Uh, spider much? What a great idea, giving Raph some free time. Because now, I can relax. Well, looky here. Huh? I see you managed to do Please! Bite them! Bite them! Please! Please, Spider, bite Gabriel and Misha. That would be amazing. Tell me the truth. I hate when they're underfoot. It doesn't bother me. Selfish. Don't worry about it. He straightened himself out and deserves some free time. <laughs> Mind if I join you? What for? Isn't hanging out with angels a drag for you? 
Uh oh. Uh oh. After is the spider gonna do what I think it's gonna do? Please do what I think you're gonna do. Hey. Uh huh. Don't forget the veto. Oh, I know. Angels and devils can never touch. It's such a sin, don't you agree? Uh oh. Yep, yep. It's got them! Yes! 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 Besides, you're not really what I would call my type. No complaints on my part. You're no rat. So I see how it is. Uh -huh. You should be ashamed of yourself. No, I... Uh... Mom's a little young for you, don't you think? In my opinion, you're a little too old for her. It would be just as bad if I were to fall in love with Sulphus. Let's check on him. Scrap. Oh! Wait, wait, wait. I thought they were gonna get uh, like, like each other. I don't know. She said I was doing fine and there was no reason to check on me. Are you trying to say you don't really think of Raph anymore? Well, it's a little more complicated than that, but the Raph chapter is pretty much all but closed. Uh, that's great. I want you to know. I'm happy for you. Anyway, tell me something about this Edward character. I want to have some fun. Oh, uh, well, have some fun, all right. I'll guarantee you that. Today is simply going to be a roller coaster ride of emotions. What are you saying? You have to come. Edward has been waiting for you for an hour. And hurry up. See? I knew his father would let him down again. Poor Edward. He must suffer a lot. Are you lost, Angel? Huh? Raph, I wasn't expecting to see you. Yeah, I'm giving Sweet a hand. But if it's a problem for you, I can go. No, that's not what I meant. You're not going anywhere, mm. buddy. Huh? And the same thing goes for you. Come on, huh? what's the problem? This will be an interesting challenge. One that we will win. Would you two cut it out? The challenge isn't important right now. Let's focus on Edward. He's upset. We need to see how he's taking this. At least and let me pretty hard, because he's kind of tearing up. I mean, this is this is just sad. Situation to him. He really is sad. You want me to do it? Philip. Hello? Hello? Oh. Edward, I'm sorry. Your father... He won't be coming today. He has an appointment. He just can't change. Hmm. Oh, so this is where the trouble starts. That... I told you it was oh, a good time. That is just mean. Like, if if you're gonna... Know, going? Like, say you're coming know, to something, should you should go. Oh, and don't drive angry. Don't ever drive angry. Oh, hurry, That's just goes. causing... That is just... Asking for trouble. Driving angry. Where do you think he's going? Who knows? Edward's completely unpredictable. That's why he's so fun. You know, if he keeps this up, he's likely to cause an accident. And some innocent person could get hurt. Yep. That's true. But what do I do? <sighs> hey, you lunatic! It's called he's driving angry and it's not good. I have to agree with them. Have you gone mad? Are you suggesting we do something... But, uh, good? We're devils. That would be insane. You already won the challenge. What else are you looking for? Kabbalah, please. It's in your best interest. Okay, okay. Mm. Because you're insisting. What do we do? Well, I have an idea. It's not necessarily good. Just save his life. Changing roads would be a good idea. Fine, whatever. Now it's all up to Sweet and Wrath. <laughs> it's not necessarily it's good. It's just like, look, if you want to keep your person, it's time to transform. let's, uh, you know, make sure he doesn't die. That, that, that's, 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 that's good on you, Selfus. Also good on you is letting Raph, you know, have her decision and... You know, respecting her choice. That's that's also good on you. It's just it was just a you know we're not necessarily doing something good, but we're just making sure your human doesn't die. Cause we're mischievous, but we don't kill. And basically, we're we're making sure you keep your job for a little while longer. Have you ever 
notice when they transform, they seem to look a little older. Maybe that's just me. You're at the end of the road, little man. But why? What did I do wrong? What have you done? You drove like a crazy person. That's what you did. You mean you and saw speedy. everything? Yep. You should have seen Edward's face when he saw us. Because police terrible. people yeah. just do twice. that. I I don't know. Well, well, I, I guess it's a well. They're guardian angels, so of course they see everything. There we go. That's that's better. She's right. We're devils. The worse things are for the Earthies, the better for us. Selfish. Where did you go? I really missed you. I was with Sweet. You knew that. And you? I told you to stay away from Raph, didn't I? I didn't do anything wrong. It's true. He didn't. Come huh? with me. I can't stand you being with him. Let's go. <laughs> How could you ever be sad? Yeah, yeah. The spider met the wrong people. Now we have a good subset stream. Excellent. The spider has done its job well. Oh, wait. Is that what we're supposed to do? Of course you did, you fool. You can't understand my genius. Forgive me, my lady. By now, Wrath and Sulphus know well their feelings for one another, but somehow they've been thus far able to resist following their hearts. And how is it possible to change their minds? With one of the strongest poisons in existence, jealousy. When ah! I get your play now. now. Not even I get it. Well, Makes now, sense. We suspected you might come to see us soon. You know what happened at the Caves of Obscurity. We have felt it, and we have seen it. Then you know this is only the latest in a series of episodes concerning my students. Yes, Wrath, the Chosen One. In order to protect her, I must have knowledge of who is targeting her. Who is her enemy? The right animals now. that attacked us at the Caves, the Ferox. They originated in Limbo. Yes, Professor, you are correct. It brings to mind an ancient legend I've heard. A story that's been whispered on the streets of Angie Town for years. It speaks of, well, a neutral... We've heard enough. You will not speak of that in our presence. But I must know what danger Raph is facing. All you must know is that your students are in danger, and you must prepare them, Professor. But they're only apprentices, students with much to learn. It will take time to make them into guardian angels. We know this. But, time but sometimes you win. don't have time. Time's a luxury, bull. And return to your students. They need your guidance and your protection. Angel. Okay. Well, Rita's getting even more and more devious. I didn't think that was possible, but it is. Oh boy, I was in. I I thought that was like a mistake that uh, the spider bit Misha and uh, Gabriel, but it wasn't. It was her plan on a dog. That is very very clever. I I applaud the cleverness of that plan because it actually makes a whole lot of sense. But we'll see uh, what happens next with the whole jealousy fueling their uh, liking each other um, even more, hopefully, in the next episode. But until then, I will be signing off. TTFN. Ta-ta for 